10 years ago when the movie Her was released, no one would think AI would get this far. But fast forward 10 years later, and the search term AI girlfriend has increased by 525% in just one year. If the AI advancement don't plateau soon, I might actually replace my girlfriend with AI. That's why in this video, I'll be discussing five AI tools that will release this year or that you can already use today. The first topic that I want to discuss are AI avatars and specifically from Heijen and also a little bit from Synthesia. When they first released, their AI avatar was honestly pretty sh I didn't feel threatened as a YouTube content creator and that's a good thing, at least for me. But now what they are releasing is kind of scary. Synthesia has released their 2.0 version and Heijen has also popped up something really cool. So with Synthesia, you can now express emotions in their AI avatar. If that doesn't sound like the movie heard, then I don't know. But take a look at this and see for yourself what you think about it. This is incredible news. I am so excited about this opportunity. Man, you can't imagine how frustrated I am about this whole situation. This is unacceptable. I just wanted to say thank you for giving me this opportunity. If these AI actually get frustrated, then it might not even be worth it to replace my girlfriend with AI. Besides that, Heijen is releasing a pretty cool new feature which is called Walking Avatars. Check out this for example. Hey, I'm Nick and I'm a walking AI avatar. I just wanted to say to you guys that you need to subscribe to Dan Kieft. Please help me shut off the system. I've walked over 100,000 steps and I'm completely lost in this park. The way it works is as followed. First, you go to the website that I will leave down in the link in the description down below. Here you are on the website. So here you can type in any text. They already have a video example right here. Hello, my name is Nick. I am generated with Heijen's avatar. But yeah, I already showed you my example, so it all makes sense for you. What you can do here is you can let it say any type of text. So for example, you can say, hey, my name is Dan and you have been pranked. So for example, you can say a text like this. I know kind of creepy, but you can send it to your friends to prank them or you can make any type of video message through this. All you have to do once you've typed in your text, you can input your email address and then you can submit it and then they will send this text for you. Currently only this avatar is available, but I'm sure you can even clone yourself while walking with this. Or you can also use other walking AI avatars for this. So the world of UGC content will have a shock when they find out about this. Next up, generative AI. Sora AI is slowly teasing us with more and more videos about what they've generated. Just take a look at this example. Do you ever wonder how Toys R Us and Jeffrey the Giraffe came to be? The son of a bike shop owner. Charles Lazarus that would go on to change toy stores forever. Now I can show you the entire video but I will link it in the description down below and to me this looks pretty creepy. It is aimed at people that like Toys R Us but honestly it sounds like the start of a horror movie. But please tell me in the comments what do you think about this? Does this scare you? And do you think it looks actually good? The only issue with Sora AI is that there's no specific release date available so it might take a few months before Sora AI finally gets released. Currently the best alternative to Sora AI is called Runway Gen 3. Here's a video that I made with Runway. In the rugged mountain terrains of Canada Deep within an ice cave lies a hidden gem. This remarkable lava tube is a true masterpiece of nature, a wonder to behold. Currently, the only way to get access to Runway Gen 3 is as follows. Go to the Runway website, then you click on Try Gen 3 Alpha. And then once you're logged in, you can get started right here. You need to have a premium account for this. This is not free. If you're looking for something free, you have to try out something else. But this is how it works. Here we can enter in our prompt. And then after we've entered it in our prompt, we can select how many seconds we want to have the duration. Keep in mind, these credits go insanely fast. So. I got about a thousand credits from upgrading and what Gentry uses is like 10 credits per second. So if you generate a 10 second clip, it will cost you 100 credits. So that means you can only generate about 10 videos before you run out. Besides this, go through their entire prompting guide. It will help you a lot in generating the best type of videos. I will be releasing a full in-depth video about this soon. And there I will give you all the details that you need to know in order to create good quality videos. The next tool or feature that I want to bring your attention to is called Opus Clip Clip Anything. And Opus Clip has been working hard behind the scenes on a tool that lets you create clips from any type of video. 
it's still in alpha testing and I currently have access to it. So I can show you a little bit of how it works. So with Clip Anything, you can clip your favorite sport moments, clip daily vlogs and cut out all the funny moments, turn any video into a short, concise video, and it can even add a voiceover, captions and editing to your clips. Now, currently, all I can show you right now is the following. So I'm in one of their Discord servers in the alpha test. And what I can do here is I can submit my videos in this Discord. And what I did, for example, right here, I entered a video of the outdoor boys. And what I asked for is clip all the parts where they capture fish. So here you can see my clip. Nice black bass. There we go. Like Close it up. So this video was 20 minutes long and I simply asked it to cut out all the parts where they were fishing. Normally that would take me a while to search up all these parts, but Opslip recognized these parts and it cut them out for me. So it will save you so much time and there are so many new opportunities with this. They are just alpha testing it now, it will be released soon though, and then we can go and dive into this further. I will leave a link to Opslip where you can try out Opslip yourself. Please note this is still in alpha testing so it won't be available yet. Next up we have some news in the large language models. Cloud AI is actually outperforming ChatGPT and other language models. While other large language models are close to hitting their plateau, Cloud AI has found a new way to go through the roof in terms of their intelligence. According to their latest updates, Cloud Reasonet is outperforming everything. With their new vision, it is able to write codes from tests that require visual reasoning, like interpreting charts and graphs, for example. Now, besides that, it can turn this data into slides, which you can then use for your presentation. Like seriously, where was this when I was still in university? Especially for coders, Cloud AI is definitely worth the upgrade over ChatGPT. It's also priced the same, so I would say try out both and consider for yourself which one is the best. Lastly, we have a new update from Eleven Labs. It's called Sound Effects. Eleven Labs has been the leading way when it comes to text to speech, but now they are also branching out. They have now launched Sound Effects, and if you go to their website, you can try it out. Create any sound you can imagine. Simply click on try a sample or scroll down a little bit and here you have a few options. You have text to speech, speech to speech and dubbing, but those are the effects we already know. Now we can do text to SFX. So what we can do, for example, we can do sounds of typing on a keyboard. Here we can click on generate and now it will generate a couple samples for us. So let's just have a listen to it. Pretty fast, quiet. It actually looks way more promising once you go inside of a level apps. This is just to try it out. So if we go to the app, then it will launch. For this, you need to have a subscription. You can get a subscription for like $5, I think. And now you can go to sound effects and here you can type in any type of sound effects that you want. They have a pretty cool demo here that I will show you. If you are a filmmaker, this might actually be huge for you. So instead of you trying to find the perfect sound effects, you can just generate them yourself. You have so many different options. Literally, it's just down to your imagination of what you can create with this. You can think of anything that you want. For example, an alien spacecraft taking off. Now let's just generate. You can hit in the settings how much you want to follow the prompt or if you want it to be more creative. I just leave it at 85. And this is what we got. Sounds pretty alien to me. There you have it. These were 10 AI tools that will be releasing soon or they already have been released. Now, if you want to try out 10 different AI tools, then click the video that's on the screen right now and I will see you in the next one.